So Miguel, it's January 2020. You're in New York City for your strong shoot. What's the vibe like? COVID was just starting to appear in the U.S., and I flew Seattle to New York, and Seattle just had its first case. Hand sanitizing like crazy. I just didn't know how bad it would get. Yeah, no doubt. The COVID came in like a wrecking ball, truly, and from out of nowhere, quite frankly. I, I remember telling the people I was with, you know, two weeks from now, guys, we're going to be fine. We're not even going to be talking about this anymore. It's just a talking point of the week, you know, election year, whatever. But of course, I was sadly mistaken. I couldn't have been more wrong because you know what happened next. Yeah, production flew off a cliff. It just went to zero. I certainly didn't uh, envy, you know, the creative professionals out there like yourself who were trying to make things work. What happened after that, though? Summer rolls around. I finally get that email from Seaway's manager, new Seaway album, three music videos. And this is how I got connected with visual artist Benjamin Lieber. And his work has just been insanely next level. He has opened my eyes to a whole new world of experimentation. And when times get tough, we need to innovate and we need to invent and we need to rewire our thinking. A wise man once said, look at this photograph. Every time I do, it makes me laugh. And you know, that really speaks to me on a number of levels as well. And I gotta say, just me personally, the music videos that I've seen, Mrs. David, Big Vibe, I mean, it's some of the best stuff I've ever seen you make. Now, granted, I've only seen maybe one of your music videos or work samples at all in my entire life, but truthfully, it's better than that. And so I really think you've done a great job, and I love where you're going. Keep up the good work, and uh, can't wait to see what 2021 has in store for you.